Mythbusters. Science helps us understand the world around us. But there's a lot of misinformation out there. It can be difficult separating science fact from science fiction. Here are a few science myths that are simply not true. Einstein failed maths. Albert Einstein is perhaps the most famous physicist ever, and he is widely considered to be a genius. Unfortunately, a lot of people believe that he struggled at maths. What is true is that when he was young, he failed a university entrance exam because his mark wasn't high enough. His marks in maths and physics were excellent, but he didn't do well at French, chemistry and biology. It seems that not even geniuses are perfect. We only use 10% of our brains. Your brain counts for about 2% of your body weight and contains billions of neurons that are constantly sending and receiving information. Yet people still say that you only use one-tenth of it. This myth possibly comes from an interview with psychologist William James in 1908. Journalists may have misunderstood him when he claimed that we are making use of only a small part of our possible mental and physical resources. If we take a brain scan though, we see that we use all the parts of our brains, just not at the same time. So, whoever repeats this myth is certainly not using enough of theirs. An apple fell on Newton's head. Here's a myth that is almost true. Sir Isaac Newton, the 17th century mathematician, astronomer and physicist, was sitting under an apple tree in his garden. Out of the blue, an apple fell on his head and he immediately came up with the theory of gravity. It is one of the most famous images in the history of science, but it might not have happened. Documents written at the time suggest that Newton did come up with his theory from observing falling apples, but one probably did not hit him on the head.